Tak, patrzy kto? Hi, I'm Tal Gilboa from Israel. I'm a vegan activist. I won the Big Brother show. And today I'm going to tell you my story to that vegan couple. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. In 2012, there were only 70,000 vegans in Israel. In Israel today, there are 400,000 vegans. That's 5% of the population. Who was one of the major influences for that change? Tal Gaboa. We had the honor of meeting Tal here in Thailand recently, and she was our special guest for episode number seven of our podcast. As you saw in the opening clip, Tal was the winner of Israel's Big Brother television show in 2014, and the impact of her presence on the show was absolutely extraordinary. In 2014, Big Brother was the most watched TV show in Israel, and Tal's intention was to get on the show and spread veganism to the mainstream. A poll showed that 49% of viewers had changed their mind regarding animal suffering and the food industry, and 60% saying that will make a change or have already made a change in their eating habits because of the show. At one point in the show, Big Brother allowed Tal's friends from the Animal Liberation Front to come into the house and show a video about what animals go through in the food industry. Animal products were removed from the kitchen and replaced with vegan alternatives. Tal was an incredibly powerful voice for the animals on the show and held nothing back. Since her time in the Big Brother house, Tal has been on another reality TV show and has had a documentary made about her life called One Angry Vegan. Our podcast interview with Tal was an incredible experience. She is an absolute powerhouse, holds nothing back. Her approach to vegan activism is hardline and she is one strong force to be reckoned with. Tal's passion and dedication for raising awareness about animal liberation is truly inspiring and motivating. Just being in her presence was like nothing we'd experienced before. In fact, at one point, she actually moved us to tears. Such is her deep passion for animal liberation. A special thank you to the Green Gallery Restaurant on Kopanyang in Thailand for hosting this interview in such a beautiful place with great vegan food. All the links for where you can listen to and download the full podcast episode of Tal's interview are in the description box below this video. If you enjoy these free podcasts, we'd love you to leave us a rating and review in iTunes. That would really help us out. We're going to play you a short clip of the podcast now. And we'd love to hear your thoughts on the full interview. You can leave your comments uh, below the notes for this podcast on our website, which is linked down below. Enjoy the clip, guys. And remember until next time that going vegan is not the most we can do. It's the least we can do. See you next video. Bye, guys. The minute that it was announced in the house that you won, go back to that. Take, mm. take us back to that moment. You're sitting on the couch wow. with one other <laughs> housemate. And then they say your name. The winner is Tal. And what happened in your mind, in your heart? I have to tell you, this whole last week in the Big Brother show, it was wow. It's the first time I said to myself, you can win. Mm. It's not that uh, a very, you know. It's not a far out possibility. It's not a far <laughs> dream. Yeah. It, it, it could it could be happened, and my father died ten years ago, and I was finding myself inside the house, keep um, talking with him, and I said, "This is the time you need to help me." Not because of the money, and not because of the all these kind of things. I need the power that people would see that a vegan activist won in the Big Brother, it's for the animals. And I talked to my father all the time and I said to myself, now I need you. Because I feel him in very uh, dramatic uh, moments in my life. I can feel him. He, he doesn't show because uh, he knows that it affects me very hard because I miss him a lot. And uh, it was my, it was my uh, I can't, I loved him so much and I miss him. So this is what I, and I, it was amazed me because, wow. Yeah, it's beautiful, yeah. yeah. It's amazed me because I, 
I don't do this kind of things, but I, I, I ask all the, the force in the world just helping me. And it, uh, it happened. And it's such a beautiful and powerful story. Yeah. You brought Luca to tears. Yeah, well, I'm just so um, inspired, I think, by Tal and the story that, um, you know, you, you feel so deeply and, you know, you called upon your deceased father and just for the, that energy and that support how much it mean, meant to you. I think you were channeling everything that you could because of the cause that you were uh, fighting for, yeah. I think, it, I'm, now I'm gonna start crying, it's gonna be a circle of tears. I think it, it moves us to hear this because that is overwhelmingly powerful and it gives us hope. I feel like we're drawing so much energy and hope from you. I, don't, you. I, I want you to know mm. how strong you are and how important your example is for vegans and non-vegans. Thank you. It, it is, it's blown us away. Thank it you. has. I have to tell you something. Uh, after five days when the show uh, over, there is a big celebration. A lot of people want to, to get inside this uh, celebrate. This is the big brother celebrate. It's uh, come, you know, after the, the season is off and uh, they did a vegan celebration. <sighs> Nice. So it's the first time and the only time. Wow. And uh, it was in a big, big club in Tel Aviv. And the owner of the club is a very tall and very muscle, muscle, uh, muscular. muscular man. And he, he came to me. He had uh, tears. tears. And he said, I have to tell you something. I'm vegan. I was like this. Oh. Wow. I couldn't believe it. I'm vegan. And... In the moment that uh, Erez, the one is uh, saying that you are the winner of the uh, he said, it, I felt like there is all the energy in the world, it was the good energy in wow. the world is just fighting the, the bad energy wow. and... Wow, it it's yes. like in uh, Avatar, the movie. Oh, I have to tell you something. Awa. The director of the...